In today's video, I'm going to teach you a quick way to import an Excel table into AutoCAD effortlessly. This can really streamline your workflow, especially when you need to transfer data precisely from your spreadsheets into your AutoCAD designs. So let's jump right into the process and make things as smooth as possible. Firstly, what you'll want to do is open the Excel file that contains the table you'd like to import. Now make sure you're clear about which specific cells in your table need to be transferred. It's often a good idea to verify the contents when you're dealing with large datasets, just to avoid any unnecessary duplications or errors down the line. Once your Excel file is open, the next step is to select the cells you wish to import into AutoCAD. You can do this by clicking and dragging over the desired range of cells. Pay close attention to ensure you've captured all the necessary information. If you're dealing with a particularly large table, scrolling down or across can help ensure nothing is missed. After selecting the desired cells, the next move is simply to copy them. You can do this quickly by using the right-click menu and selecting Copy. Or you could use the handy keyboard shortcut, Control plus C on a PC, or Command plus C on a Mac, if you prefer keeping your hands on the keyboard. Once you have the data copied, switch over to your Open AutoCAD drawing, where you want this information to appear. Within AutoCAD, navigate to the point in your drawing where you'd like to place the Excel data. Make sure this area is suitably prepared for the new information. It can save time later in terms of alignment and scale checking. You're now ready to paste the copied cells into your AutoCAD file. Simply right-click in your desired location and choose Paste, or use the shortcut Control plus V on a PC or Command plus V on a Mac. Upon pasting the information, a dialog box will pop up on your screen. This dialog allows you to adjust the text height according to your specific requirements. It's crucial to choose a text height that fits well with the existing elements of your drawing to ensure everything remains visually consistent and legible. Once you've set your text height, click OK to finalize the import process. And there you have it. Your table from Excel should now be neatly integrated into your AutoCAD design, ready for further editing or annotation. This method is a real time saver, helping you effortlessly bridge the gap between your spreadsheet and drafting work. Thanks for watching, and I hope this guide has been helpful for your next project.